After upgrading your car with the Cosworth FA20 Performance Package, the next step is to reflash the ECU so that the engine performs optimally with the newly installed components. Matt Feezy, Senior Engineer at Cosworth, walks us through reflashing the ECU of your FA20 engine. Your FA20 Performance Package comes with the necessary hardware and maps to carry out reflashing. But first, download the Pro ECU software from Ecutech's website and install it on your laptop. Pro ECU is your visual interface to create backup ROMs and perform reflashing tasks. Refer to the instructions printed on the inside of the Ecutech box. Connect the Ecutech cable to the OBD2 port on your car located beneath the steering column and the green LED should light up. Connect the other end to a USB port on your laptop along with a supplied security dongle and Cosworth memory stick containing the maps. Connecting the Ecotech cable via a USB hub has been proven to offer a faster ROM programming time. Startup Pro ECU. Green indicators will confirm a reliable connection. Turn the ignition on, but don't start the car. Select Detect Vehicle from the Tools menu. Click OK. A new window will open with various options. Select Query ECU. Your ECU version will be displayed along with a list of compatible ROM files. Next, it is important to back up your current ROM to a file. Click on Read ROM. This procedure will write out a bin file that can be used to reflash the ECU back to an original state. The backup progress is displayed on the bottom of the window while the bin file is being generated and the procedure should only take a couple of minutes. When the information prompt appears, switch the ignition off. Wait, and then another message will appear to switch ignition on. Go ahead and do so. Upon completion, an information window should pop up confirming where your newly created ROM file has been written, normally the Ecotech installation folder. Click OK. Now you're ready to reflash your ECU with a Cosworth ROM file. Click on Choose ROM file and navigate to your Cosworth USB stick containing the ROM files. Select the ROM file for your car and performance package level. For further information on selecting the correct ROM file, refer to the lookup table on page 5 within the installation instructions on the USB stick to match up the ROM file to the specification of your particular car. With the ignition still on, click Program ECU to begin reflashing. The progress is displayed as a percentage on the bottom of the window and the rev counter on the dash will begin to climb. When the information prompt appears, switch the ignition off. Wait, and then another message will appear to switch ignition on. Go ahead and do so. The software will then restart the ECU and attempt to clear any fault codes. Wait for this process to complete and a final pop-up window will confirm that the programming sequence has completed. Click OK. Congratulations, you've successfully reflashed the ECU on your FA20 engine. Start the car up and you're good to go.